Hey, everybody. I can see everyone. I don't know what they're talking about. I couldn't think of a better video to come out after than Ben Brown's Canada video. Holy cow. Uh, we got that at 5 a.m. last night. Ben was still working on it. Uh, and we, we, we offered him the opportunity about half a year ago, and he's been working on it since then. So thank you so much, Ben. Uh, there he is. Incredible. You make me, you as a, as a Brit, make me proud to be Canadian. It's gorgeous. Thank you so much for making content like that. Are you guys enjoying the gala? What do you think? Was it worth it? Cool. Very cool. Um, so I'm just going to make a couple of really quick announcements. It's nothing too important. We just wanted to let you know that we are doing Buffer Festival again next year. We've already booked the dates, and so we thought it's worth telling you because last year we weren't sure and we had to count our pennies and make sure I didn't go bankrupt. Uh, but we know that we're fine this year, so in 2015, Buffer Festival we will be taking place in Toronto, October 22nd through 25th. And we're very happy to be back. But that's not actually uh, the announcement I'm really excited to tell you because there is an announcement that I'm really, 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 really excited to tell you. Uh, Corrado came up earlier and he talked about the Uplist short films, which was our opportunity to accept videos from anyone, anywhere in the world um, to put their videos on the big screen. And like he pointed out, I was at the screening earlier today and it was incredible. Um, but that's not enough. It's not enough. Uh, it's really, it's not, it's not bugging us, it's just this ongoing challenge that we care about content, we care about making videos, and to, to the YouTube creators in the room, there's about a hundred of us here out of the thousand people that are in this room right now, a lot of this knowledge seems very obvious. It's like, oh yeah, it's, it's so obvious how the site works, it's obvious how to shoot, it's obvious how to edit, and it's not for the majority of people, and it's something that we take for granted. And so there's something that we really wanted to do, we as Apprentice A, we as Buffer Festival, and that was not just promote or support um, upcoming filmmakers, but to actually give back. And so I had a really, we've had a really great relationship with YouTube and putting Buffer Festival together. They've supported us heavily, and they have really proven that they care about Canada, which is awesome. And we want to prove that we care about Canada and and the entire international YouTube community. So I am so excited to tell you that the next buffer thing happening is not October 22nd. There's a buffer thing happening much, much, much sooner than that because in early 2015, we are launching the Buffer Grant. And what we are going to do is we are going to be giving lots of money to up and coming YouTubers that apply. We're going to find them, hand select them as YouTubers. No corporate involvement, no network involvement, no industry involvement. But we're not just gonna give them money as if that's not enough. We're gonna give them money and training and education. And we're gonna connect them to the YouTubers that, that have some experience, the YouTubers that know. And we're going to work with them throughout all of 2015. We are going to help them start up their channels, help them get set up, help them redesign everything, help them collaborate, bring them to Los Angeles and shoot at YouTube Space LA, bring them to Toronto next year to Buffer Festival, and then next year, their short films that we funded will play on the big screen. We have one sponsor, one is enough, YouTube. Thank you. It's pretty cool. I see Shane just nodding a lot. He has the biggest nod. Do, will you commit to helping train a new generation of YouTubers? Nothing. What's that, Craig? Five. With more on the way? Shay commits to tweeting it. Thank you, Shay. Thank you, Shay. 
All right, I've been on stage long enough. Um, I have to stay on a little bit longer. It is my pleasure to set up the very last video of the night. But luckily, Buffer Festival is not over because there is an entire day's worth of festival tomorrow. There's a ton of screenings happening tomorrow. Uh, and next year, Buffer Festival being four days, we are going to have another day of screenings. And to talk about the future, we eventually want it to be five days and six days. And there are some YouTubers that are like, it's so long. Oh, man, why am I going to Toronto for five days? Well, it's going to get longer and longer. Our goal is to eventually be like the Toronto International Film Festival, be 10 days long, and be nothing but premieres. Give us a couple years, we're working on it. Anyways, the last video of the night is made by one of my favorite YouTubers, but I don't want to put too much pressure on him. Uh, Owen Rogers, could you join me on stage? Hey, what's up? Hi. What's up? We met yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. But we've been talking for... Since yesterday. <laughs> That's true, and also for a couple months. Yeah, yeah. You know what was really Good text. neat? Um, when we were putting, I just realized, remember the story. When we were putting this year's Buffer Festival together, we were looking at YouTubers that we wanted to invite, and Joel said to me, like, hey, you should bring Olin Rogers. And I was like, oh my God, I've never talked to him. Joel, you and, sneaky dog. And I looked on Twitter, and I already followed you, of course, and you also followed me. Instantly. No, before. Before? Yeah. You followed me for years. Thanks Instantly. For, thanks for years reading ago. my tweets. Thank you so much. Thanks. Do you want to talk a little bit about your video? Well, first off, I just want to thank you for selecting me to make a film about Star Wars. That's freaking fantastic. I mean, little kid me was popping in VHSs of this, and this is everything. This is a huge dream come true. Even if it's a fan film, it's... When you got off, when I got off the phone, I was like fist pumping for like 25 minutes <laughs> outside of a Best Western. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> so it's fantastic. Um, and then I want to thank you for putting on this festival. Um, I think, just give everybody a round of applause for Corey and Apprentice A for putting on this awesome you festival. Guys. You, 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 you. It's a ton you, of work. You. I know. And it's fast, just awesome hotels. Can I say that? Great hotels. The pillows are like angel hair. <laughs> it's fantastic. Anyway, so my <laughs> film, it's a Star Wars fan film, as you guys know already. Yeah. Got a couple woos. I oh, got a little few more woos. Yeah. Um, really, I don't even know what to say about it. It's just a Star Wars yeah, fan film. Are, that's, all, that's all we needed. That's all you guys need to yeah. know. It's a Star Wars it's fan It's full film. on contact, jock straps and all. Let's do this. Let's go. All right. <laughs>